All right. It's Kyle. Kyle! There he is. <laughs> you ready to work out? Let the season begin. Hey Kyle, you know what you need, bro? A great arm day. I was just telling her, I was like, really hope he doesn't pick shoulders, but he didn't. <laughs> just warming up here, the triceps. Do triceps and then biceps. So for me, this is just a little bit of a warm up. Kyle, you might want to back off the weight a little bit. You <laughs> chose violence today, all right. This might be too much for you to handle, pal. Probably. <laughs> that chest is still sore. That's what happens when you work out with me, man. Legs are still sore from that stupid leg press. My back isn't that bad, but tomorrow we'll be telltale sign of whether or not we're really sore. There we go. Now I'm good. This feels good, man. Alright, you went 15. 12 to 15, keep it 15. Yeah, you look different, man. Body Tre by Derek. Trevor and I were talking about that today, man. Both you and Trevor both look different. <clears throat> can really turn my elbows and wrists out like that. Get the most out of the reps. It definitely made a difference. really feel out that time under tension on this one. Like really spend a lot of time throughout the whole range of motion here, for real. Squeeze slow, big stretch. Try to just make it harder than it needs to be. Really flaring those elbows out. Get that good contraction, even the chest. Like 15 should be burning your triceps. It's Friday, and we're here in the gym. What time is it, like five o'clock? Friday Somewhere night, there? baby. Where's everybody at? Come on now. I'm trying to get better today, man. Ooh, Friday night at the bar. Let's go. If you get to 12 and that feels like 90%, just stop. If you can go to 15, go to 15, but don't, don't burn yourself out here. Ugh. 
Let's go from four plates to two plates. Can we do a drop set? Yeah, from four plates to two plates immediately. So drop two plates off each side. I can count. It's my complete idiot. No. <laughs> Comment below. I, I, what you I, think. I, don't, <laughs> I don't even need to see his face. I know what kind of face he gave me. Alright. He's like, well. I wanted to do more. <laughs> no, I, it was fine. I thought I could do a few more, but. Would you do seven, eight for, the, for four or five? I'd like seven or, yeah, right, seven. Cool. And then, um. I didn't count those. That one was like 10, but. <laughs> well, it was more from all the other stuff we just did, you know? I was already pumped. So like I was telling you earlier, like that one day, the more you pre-exhaust and pump up, it's harder to lift heavier weights, you know? The only place I excel, that's great. Yeah, yeah. So, that pre-exhaustion sucks. That's what we did over there on the ropes. Tricep push down and then did a few working sets here before we did that, so. It's good, that was my, um, my top set here. And uh, we can go move on to something else, so one more set for you. I was so blown up already, you know? Like, uh, I noticed that, like, the first couple exercises, my right was getting stimulated a lot more than my left. But on this, I was able to do a lot more with my left arm because my right had already been pre exhausted up to this point, you know? Not pre exhausted, just exhausted from this at this point. So, I was able to do more with my my left and my right, but that's why it's good to throw in some unilateral exercises. So that way you're not just doing, you know, both limbs at the same time. When I say limbs, arms, legs, whatever. So it's good to, you know, isolate one one specific muscle group, you know? One, one arm at a time or one leg at a time. Whatever, that way it keeps balance, evens everything out. Well, it's different for me. I'm not used yeah. to the, the amount of volume we're doing. Most people don't like the. They like, most people are set in their ways of mm -hmm. how to train, and they don't want to try something new. 
So that's why I say I'm proud of you, man, because you like really stepped up to a different style of training. You're putting in that work, you know, you're pushing yourself every day. It's good, and you're transforming, it's awesome. I, I really was saying that. Body by Derek. <laughs> much triceps left. We're almost done here. And we'll do we'll do some biceps. That's it for triceps. Gosh. Oh. trains heavy he trains hard trains intense but sometimes just little changes in a workout especially like time under tension or exercise selection and you know um, just chaining the exercises and sets together properly you know that that can make a world of difference because like I said I see Kyle in here all the time he's busting it every single day um, but just minor tweaks even going a little lighter actually um, we've seen a, a big, big difference in just like one to two weeks of, uh, of working out. Python, baby.
So what I want to do is we warmed up with uh, just strictly the bicep, like more of like the peak. Did that here too as well. Now we're going to hit more of the bicep and the um, brachialis and brachioradialis. So it's more of like moving from here to where we started to more in this area, but we're still hit, hitting the biceps as well. And then what we'll do is after this, we'll either go back to doing more of like the peak or we will do reverse grip and finish off the outer side here. So either way, we're, we're gonna do this and then we're gonna come back and do like spider curls, focus a little bit more on the peak again. And after that, probably be done. So you saw me, uh, I went more out like this. I did hammer curls more like out here, two at a time. And then I, and then I did one at a time. And then once I got tired, I went like cross body. Well, two I was, at a time. So not like I was normally doing, but when you get tired, we're coming in. This time, I want you to come in, yeah. Well, at the end, yeah. the whole way, yeah. So I, so I did them the normal way. Same thing, two, two, till you get tired, then you go one, 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 one. So you get, you're smoked out here, and after that, cross body, so it kind of brings it more back into the bicep. Cross body, two reps, two reps, until you get tired and you go one rep at a time. And then you're just, you can't even feel your arms anymore. You don't even know what's going on. You can't even think straight, all the blood's in your arms, not even in your brain. Mm. <laughs> hey. Hey.
Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh boy. Oh shoot. Oh. Uh, oh wait, you full. Uh, Let's go. Okay, that's it. Alright, so we're gonna finish up here doing a uh, reverse grip. Go with that. Spot. I got it. Ten. I got it. Uh, uh, mm. uh. Let's go. Oh. See this? <laughs> I can't even lift my fingers up because this is so lit up. You know, you know when we do like the. Oh, there's knees back there. I don't know. You know when we do like the tibialis anterior, like the front of the calf. Let me tell you about using big words. And you and you can't like raise your toes anymore. Yeah. That's how I feel with with my fingers. I can't even raise my fingers. We out of here. We are done. That's it. Arm day was a success.